Overzealous Republicans, overzealous conservatives have been trying to chip away abortion rights since Roe v. Wade, and the Dobbs decision basically gave them air to do exactly what they wanted to do from the beginning. But quite frankly, before the Dobbs decision came down, we had states across this country that already had hypervigilant anti-choice laws in place. Many of them included bans past certain weeks. Many of them included having to visit the doctor multiple times, therefore limiting um, your access to, to the abortion pill. Uh, purposely. In addition to that, extreme and egregious um, penalty for doctors who performed abortions, particularly in a hospital setting. So this has been something that Republican states have been chipping away for quite some time, and something that even under the Obama administration, there were over 400 bills that were pushed within conservative state and conservative-leaning state legislatures that were anti-choice. This is something that's been a long time coming, and I think we have to be real about that. We also have to be real about the populations who are going to be the most affected. It's going to be women in poverty. It's going to be women of color. It's going to be women who cannot work through the patchwork of states that may have um, abortion allowances. Depending on where you are, it may be extremely hard for you to get to those states. The cost of flights, the cost of train, the cost of travel in general, hotel costs, things like that, recovery. In addition, I would probably argue um, something that's a little bit different from what your previous panelists said, because quite frankly, yes, gerrymandering has changed the composition of certain districts, but there are a lot of white women who will vote in support of anti-choice who, when given the option in these polls, will say that they support actually having uh, a woman's right to choose. So we're also seeing this dichotomy where some of the very people who would benefit from being women, benefit from having this ability, are some of the same people who are voting in support of elected officials who are chipping away at it every day.